the channel guys i'm ryan you're watching the nighthawk bros so today we're going to take a look at the three ak competitions in the united states today now as of late i've gotten really into uh, learning the ak as a weapons platform and being proficient with it and that has kind of evolved into me wanting to compete now so i've been doing my research and looking to see what kind of competitions i can do to get into and uh, one, get my feet wet kind of in the competitive sense. I, I did compete years ago in PA Steel, so with a pistol that was stationary, you know, engaging steel targets, boom, boom, boom. And that was really fun. I enjoyed the competitive aspect of that. So I really wanted to do something else and, and take that to the next level. I never got into three gun, was asked to do three gun with some other guys, never really got into that. And I, yeah, so that's kind of where we're at. It's kind of how we got here. So in my research, I found three competitions that I think would be great for next year, and it's something I'm looking personally to do, and Sean's talking about doing it with me as well. So let's take a look. First one is from Rifle Dynamics. It is Red October. I think it's one of the longest running AK competitions out there. Don't quote me on that. Um, I'm relatively new to all this, but from my research that I found, it definitely seems like it is the oldest uh, AK competition in the US. So the competition itself is going to be held in Las Vegas, Nevada, and that is October 23rd to the 24th. And this is being called the Kalashnikov Championship. So the event looks really awesome. Uh, you can shoot com block weapons, so some nine millimeter, like submachine gun style weapons, SKS is Mosin's if you really wanted to. So it's kind of a really cool event, honestly. I'd love to go run it with an SKS um, if I can get my hands on a Yugo, which I know the prices right now are ridiculous, but if I could, I would definitely try to do that. So if you would like more information on Red October, where to sign up and actually look at some of the courses, I will leave a link down in the description so you can go do that. Moving on to number two, and this one has got me pretty excited. Uh, I'm really stoked to go do this with Mayor Fugly Cool next year, Kalesh Bash in Texas. This thing looks freaking sweet. It is a bunch of AK loving people getting together, having one heck of an event. I mean, this is probably the coolest event. So I hope you got some money saved. This is going to be in the October 9th and 10th window. So bam, bam, October is packed with AK events. So at both the events, you can get in to spectate. You're gonna spend around $100 for Kalash Bash to get in and spectate the event, and around $200 if you wanna compete in the event. Now tickets are sold out, so unfortunately you'll have to wait for pre-registration uh, next year. But uh, yeah, that's what I'm looking to do. And I think, don't quote me on this, but registration opened up sometime in May. And let me tell you what, it sold out really quick. There's also camping available at Kalesh Bash. It looks like a great time the, from all the pictures and videos that I've seen. It's absolutely amazing. And Mayor Fugly Cool said that everyone has a great time. There's also some hotels and everything nearby, which I believe he's doing. So if you're at Kalesh Bash, go say hi to Mayor Fugly Cool. Tell him Ryan from the Nighthawk Bros said hi. Campsites do cost around $75 if you would like to camp. So the third event is going to be the AK Masters from Palmetto State Armory. This is going to be in South Carolina at the Clinton House. So the dates for that are June 25th through the 27th. This is going to be a really easy event for me to get to. It's only eight hours away from where we're at. So we'll drive down and camp. There is camping available, which is really nice. And it looked like it was a great event. Spectator passes for this event will cost around $25, which I think is really reasonable, and $40 for both days. If you would like to go spectate, you can do that as well. You know, if you're just looking to get your feet wet, kind of expose yourself to what's going on, I was actually going to do that uh, this past weekend, but some stuff came up. It's all good. We will definitely get a chance to go out and compete next year. Okay, so these competitions are all relatively the same with their divisions. There's a traditional, traditional open, open and PCC open. So they all kind of have the same thing. AK Masters doesn't look like they will allow any com block style weapon in the PCC class. It looks like it has to be an AK style only. So your pistol, pistol caliber carbines have to be an AK variant. So you can't run something like a PPSH, darn. So I'm really looking forward to next year. 2022 is going to be an epic year for us, to say the least. So join us on our journey to become more proficient with the AK platform. If you have any comments, concerns, or questions, leave them down in the comment section. I'm really curious to see what everyone has to say. I'm really curious to see if there's any 
competitions that I missed or any that are out there that uh, you guys know about that I completely missed. <laughs> so thank you so much for checking out the video. I will catch you on the next one. Thank you.